Now this example deals with an annuity. Now annuities are common for retiring, but they're also found when you're saving for university and going back to school, or if you're taking some time off for a big holiday. In a way, it's just allowing the bank to use your money to pay you out. Now in this case, the bank is paying Sandy out $10,000. Let's pull out our TVM solver. Our present value? Well, this is money that came out of Sandy's pocket and went to the bank. So let's put that in as negative 10,000. Well, we expect that we're paying out this total amount over this time. So future value should be zero. The periods, well, we're talking about two years and 12 payments per year. So the periods is 24. The interest rate is 6%. The payment amount, well, that's what we're figuring out. So we'll skip that. We have 12 payments per year. And we're told that we have two compounds per year, semi-annual. So we click the question mark and solve for the payment amount. And we end up with plus 442.87. And we think, yes, this is payments that are coming from the bank and they're going into our pocket. So a plus makes sense. So we can conclude that the monthly payments that Sandy receives are $442.87.